Uh, I like the uh, and, and continue to improve. Uh, and my English is better than them, but but <laughs> I like these guys. You um, how has that we don't know yet. <laughs> don't know yet. <laughs> Obviously, I want to score more because I think this will help to to at the end get the the target. O Richardson meteu um hat trick, tá bom que é pré-temporada, mas o que mais surpreendeu, além dos três gols, foi o inglês do crack, que deixou até o parça dele, o Emerson Royal, surpreso com toda a desenvoltura e calma do jogador brasileiro ao ser entrevistado na língua inglesa. O Rich tá mandando bem, hein? E olha, tomara que o Rich não faça igual na temporada passada que iludiu no começo e depois não jogou mais nada. E a gente espera que não só ele, mas um outro atacante camisa 9 faça também a mesma coisa. Mas esse já fala inglês muito bem há muito tempo, que é o biscoito do Shrek, que falou que vai meter ele muito gol e até mais do que o Haaland na próxima temporada. A gente espera que os dois realmente se destaquem aí nessa temporada que chega da Premier League. Mas uma coisa que tem que se destacar mais ainda é este canal, com o seu likezinho, a sua inscrição neste canal, para se tornar um traidor, é claro, deixar o teu comentário aqui embaixo. Me conta se você acha que os dois... Vão fazer a diferença para os seus times, para o Arsenal e para o Tottenham. Qual dos dois vai ser o camisa 9 da seleção brasileira do Antelote? Ou não vai ser nenhum dos dois e vai ser o Tiquinho Soares? Me conta aí. Então não vamos perder mais tempo. Bora assistir o Rich falando inglês, Gabriel Jesus falando inglês e bora lá. Emerson, Richie, well done. 5-1. And a hat-trick for you, Richie. I mean, I know it's pre-season, but goals mean a lot, right? Yes, I'm, I'm over the moon. I'm uh, so happy. Uh, thank you, uh, fans. Thank you, Singapore, for this pre-season. Uh, I, like, I like Singapore, and this pre-season is good for me and for the group. Emerson Royal, tell me about this guy. Tell me about this guy. This guy is, is amazing. I, I speak every time about Richie because this guy served uh, the goals, the best uh, for me is, is very good stuff. He stay with him. In the, the third goal, I passed to him. So I'm so happy with this. He's had some tough times last season, but this season, it just feels it's going to be his season, right? Yeah, it's very important for us. We need to, we need to push. We need to go back with the, the Champions League, the, the, I don't know, the, the Europe, because uh, we have team for this. Uh, we will try in this season, so uh, for us it's very important the, the pre-season, we need to, to push every time. Uh, we, we, we have more three weeks maybe, we need to push a little bit more and for the, 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 the season. Richie, you got the hat trick. I know you're so desperate to do well for this club, aren't you? Next season, what you, how are you feeling? Yeah, I'm good. I'm feel good. Uh, last season, uh, I had uh, um, too many injuries, and then now I'm, I feel good. My body is good. I think it's it a good season for me. Now I've asked Emerson about you. Tell me about this guy. How well is he playing at the moment? Ah, uh, I'm a, uh, a good player. He's my brother. Uh, my family, uh, I like the uh, uh, and, and continue to improve. Uh, and my English is better than them, but but <laughs> I like these guys. You two together, well done, well done. Hey, come on, eh? Come on, sports. So yeah, I'm total agree with him. You know, I was obviously more younger than Gundo when uh, I joined the club. So that was one of my my ideas and the reason why I I accept to to join City in that time. You know, I was young. I want to learn, and then also the squad was young. You know, with some experienced players. So, yeah, I totally agree with him. How would you compare this? Your second preseason with Arsenal, having been here for an entire year, with last summer when you joined the team and pretty much stepped right onto the plane to Baltimore. I think uh, it's quite the same, you know, the energy, every, everyone wants to work, to get fitness and then obviously to start the season well like we did last season because it's so important, Premier League, you know, guys, is so strong competition, difficult, so 
I think about the fitness uh, is so important. You mean the in this game or in this season? No, in the season ahead. Oh, we create this, you know, like we did so well. Unfortunately, we didn't win the Premier League. Was our main target, but at least we get that fight, you know, with the one of, or if not the best team in the world, you know, you we fight till the end. So I think he'll be the same energy, you know. Now I think people uh, believe more in us because you know the 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 work we put in the on the pitch last year was top, and then obviously everyone here wants to continue and to increase the level again. I'm sure, it takes time to get into the rhythm again. How are you feeling now, and do you feel sort of back to your absolute physical? Yeah, comparing with my my injury on my foot, 2017 is so different, you know. So this is my first injury, and I hope it's the last one on the knee. So now I'm suffering a little bit more than on my foot. So yeah, uh, have been hard, but I'm working hard to to get fitness and then come back strong. I think at the time of the recovery, I think you spoke about being a different animal when you came back. Is that the plan still? You feel like a different animal now? Uh, yeah, for sure. I want to. I want to help. I want to work. You know. I want to uh, to learn from the Mister with the players as well, and then for of course. Um, how has that we don't know yet. Okay, so just in the leadership group, has anything changed for you? Is there sort of have you felt you've had to step up with Granite leaving now within the group? Uh, I think nothing changed. You know, I'm. A type of captain I don't talk a lot, but I show with my actions, you know, I run, I fight, I want to win, you know, I put a lot of emotions in my, my game played. So, uh, yeah, I will obviously always try to help uh, the young players, you know, I'm still young, but I think if you want everyone see me as a experienced player here. So, yeah, I want to help everyone with my actions and speak. Your role is so important to the team's overall play, but do you have a goal or a target for the number of goals you want this year? And do you feel like you may need to be more selfish to, to keep improving on your goal scoring record? Uh, always in my life, I, I have been, uh, I have only one target, you know, at the end, I celebrate everyone together with the title, win titles. That's my main target. Obviously, I want to score more because I think this will help to, to at the end get the, the target, but uh, I don't mind, you know, I, obviously I want to score more, but I want to win titles and then that's my main target. Put it at the end of a cycle. Looking, looking from outside, you know, uh, I think Arsenal did, did not start now, I think start years ago and now it's like, it's working paid, you know, like uh, obviously it's coming more players to help us, you know, but we still have a lot of good players as well. So these players is coming to help. And then, well, I think uh, it's a very good problem for the mister, no? The gap between Arsenal and Manchester City was quite big, but with everything that you achieved last season, do you feel that gap is a lot smaller now than it was a year ago? Even before I was feeling like this, you know, the gap was not that big. Obviously, they are together years, and then uh, this makes difference, and they are winning. Uh, for years, that make difference also. But uh, season day one, I arrive here. I believe we can fight, we can win. And uh, unfortunately, we didn't know win, but I think we we will win, for sure. Well, it's difficult to to know, you know. Uh, but I believe sometimes at the end, you know, at the end of the season, uh, we was a little bit nervous as a team, you know. Uh, and they they was not nervous because normally they win, so uh, that's make difference. So I think this year we are more experienced about this, and it will be different. <laughs>